Sacred Pepper in the Carrollwood area of Tampa. Tonight is a Yelp event where we get to taste all the food and drink all the drinks, and you're going along with me. I just got pixie fied, pixie dusted. <laughs> all right, I'm about to try one of these Dragon Balls. Yes. You were giving out these Aloha drinks. Tell me what is in these Aloha drinks. So we vanilla, smashed pineapple, uh, simple syrup, and pineapple juice. That sounds amazing. You know this girl loves a good tiki drink or anything that has the word Hawaiian in it. So let's give it a shot. It's amazing. I'm not supposed to have pineapple juice, but you know what? I'm gonna drink it anyway tonight. I'd like to start off by thanking you guys. You guys are our most active Yelpers. You guys are the ones who are writing the highest quantity and highest quality of reviews, adding the most helpful photos. And I honestly say that this is very helpful for me because I only have limited um, amount of money and limited amount of calories, and I'm not willing to spend it on a bad meal. So. And we also have wine. It looks like meatballs. Yes. And then that might be calamari, perhaps? Calamari. And salmon or some sort of fish. And then I think believe crab cakes. Alright, the next that they're serving us is a Pinot Noir. Thousand Oaks is good, I believe you said. I happen to like Pinot Noir. Now, the reason I couldn't talk on those other ones is the man was trying to explain everything. It got louder later on, but that's why I couldn't talk. The man was trying to explain stuff. But I'm going to try this Pinot Noir right now. Oh, this is a good one. Not my favorite of all Pinot Noirs. I happen to like La Crema Pinot Noir the best, but it's a little, it's a little on the oaky side, and it's better than that Chardonnay. The Chardonnay was good, but it was a little too citrusy. mozzarella cheese finished with a tomato tapenade over our caramelized butter. Did you see what this is? That's a lemon with salmon. salmon. And short ribs with pasta. So they gave us a lot of food here. So the first thing is this giant potato tot that they had us dip into this maple syrup. My friend Alan next to me said it's like Thanksgiving. Oh, actually, it's a sweet potato tot. And you dip it in the uh, this maple dip. Let's see how it is. And he's 100% right. It tastes like Thanksgiving. <laughs> it does. All right, the other thing is I have on the plate is some Brussels sprouts. Now, I really only like Brussels sprouts when my husband makes it, because he roasts it. But I already had a piece of it. It's actually really good. Alright, next up is going to be the filet mignon. Now, I typically like the meat pretty well done. This one I took an end piece. So, I'll try this. Oh, it's really good. Short rib. This is really, looks really good. This is my favorite so far. There's also corn on my plate. This is going to be like probably corn. There's a chicken dish that just really looks like chicken and mozzarella. And then the last piece is salmon. Salmon. I believe there might be one more drink coming up. I think it's a dessert drink. And um, I'll come back and show you that too. Ah, uh, dessert. I don't know what it is, but we got some sort of ice cream cones and oh, this ice is a do it yourself Sunday. Oh, it's a do it yourself Sunday. This is a caramel peach martini. That is definitely a dessert drink. Wow. You can taste the peach. It's got cream in it. So you have to like cream in your drink. It's very different and very good. 
This is a creme brulee bread pudding. It tastes like pound cake to me. It tastes like my grandma's pound cake from back of the day. This is the ice cream. So they have this huge thing of ice cream. Everyone took some. Your own little cone. And chocolate. I think it's hot fudge and caramel. And these look like uh, sugar coated pecans. Right. She said this might have peanut butter in it. We'll see. It tastes like vanilla. It's good. It's all homemade. I opted not to do the sauces on mine. So far, dessert here is really, really good. I am home from the event. They gave us this packet thing. I think it's just for like catering and stuff. It's all about their different events and things like that. And they gave us a present. So I wanted to open it up for you guys. It looks like starting out, I get a complimentary urban pizza. Urban pizza, it says, made with scratch dough and smothered with farm fresh toppings. Ooh, my husband's always been wanting to go to the Sacred Pepper, so we will have to have a night out there especially now that we get free pizza. I have a feeling there's gonna be something dessert-wise in here. I am so full. I took a little bit of everything and still didn't finish everything on my plate. There was so much food. I think my favorite was the braised ribs on top of the pasta. And the uh, there was a sw that sweet potato dipped in that maple syrup. That was really good. Actually, the corn was good too. Oh, these are the pralines. The girl across from me didn't like them that much, but yeah, these are these were actually very good. All right, so the Sacred Pepper. Um, this was the Elite Yelp event. I do recommend going to the Sacred Pepper. I will be uh, going back there for sure, especially to use my coupon and have a night out. And they have like a lot of different nights out. They have like ladies night and, and different nights. So Sacred Pepper, I will put the link in the description below if you wanna check out uh, where they are. It's on Dale Maybury Highway in Tampa, in the Carrollwood section of Tampa. Well, thank you for tuning into the wonderful world of Wendy. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. Give me a thumbs up and I'll see you on my next adventure. Bye. Thank you.